Welcome to the hodgepodge of hilarity, where we've still not quite made a decision, which is slightly unfortunate, but there you go. We're going to carry on looking. I'm just sort of, I'm, I'm kind of assessing everything, having a look through all the options. See which one leaps out the most. I can't deny it, they're not necessarily leaping out as fast as I was hoping they might. But nonetheless, I think we'll get there in the end, I'm sure. As I say, there's a lot of old favourites that are tempting. But I just wanted to double check my sort of emulation games. And you know what? Yeah, we don't need that window anymore, so that's fine. I'm going to have another go of that one. I remember playing it a little while back and it's alarmingly difficult, but uh, was quite amusing. I will, however, I think, yeah, it's going to need a new thingamabob. So with a bit of luck, we can activate the thingamabob fairly swiftly. But it's Tharsis. I don't know if that actually... Uh, there we go. It's, I did update that time. Now I just have to find out whether I broke it. No, I think we're okay. Ding! Oh, no. Oh, uh, hey, oh, what's this? What's this? Okay. None of it's on the screen, so it doesn't matter. But, yeah. I would prefer you not to randomly shove uh, things here. <laughs> That's as most people will say. Uh, do, 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 do. But I think it's this damn sort of you need to do a thing. I think we had this problem last time and I'm just having to redo the thing. So <laughs> bear with me. It will appear on the screen I'm sure. Yeah. Eventually. <laughs> Eventually. There we go, I think we've gotten we've gotten in there. We'll get to a menu. And then I will pop it uh, on screen. I lied, I'm not gonna wait until we get to a menu. Uh, create new capture specific window please. Capture that specific window please. Uh, I think it might be worthwhile keeping the cursor on for this one. Just because it is using the mouse and keyboard. Uh, with a bit of luck, we'll be over there. Let me push that, and then it should appear, question mark? Maybe not so much. No, no, there we go. Okay, so if we can get this to work. It will be perfect. However, hey, perfect. We're blasting into space. So, all right, fine. I'm sorry. Don't know if I can skip this. Oh, there we go. I think I found the skip button. Hello there, General Blue Bush. A yar to you too. How fares your further pirating? I hear you demolished a enemy boat by doing a stealth TNT blast. That sound, that sounded spectacular. Um, well played, well played. I'm sneaking some, uh, sneaking some bits and bobs in there. Right, so I think we just want to do a new game, probably just a standard one. Uh, do 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 do. Okay, so we can randomise it again, or we can just leave it as it is. Uh, are they? Oh, they are nameable. So if I don't think, I don't think, I think it's literally just you uh, at the moment. But if there is anybody else, you got a free fruit crate. Well, that's something, I suppose. Would you like to be a doctor, a specialist, a mechanic, a captain, and would you like your name attached to one of them? I don't know if you can change their sort of portraits. Oh no, I just changed the thing out. Mechanic, 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 mechanic. Mr. Blue Bush is now the mechanic. Oh, I'm sorry. Blah, blah. Right. Easy difficulty? Yeah, we'll start with easy, because if memory serves, this game was 
and troublesome because it's all about those dice about those dice about those dice and do you know what dice don't like they don't like you Oh, that's interesting. Oh, very fascinating. Wasn't expecting that. Oh, yeah, no, I know, every, everything's gone to shit. But yeah, it's interesting. If you look, look at the mouse carefully. And I know this is not, this is not sort of um, important. But if you look at the mouse, this is me taking the mouse off to the edge of the screen to theoretically make the mouse disappear from the screen. So for cutscenes, it's quite useful. Oh! Well, now it has actually disappeared because it went over to the other screen. Easier to show it at the bottom, I think. But look, it's like, now, this this should disappear from my screen. It's disappearing from my actual screen. But, oh my lord, it's sunk. It's in the overlay. What's the mouse doing in the overlay? Squeak, 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 squeak. But yeah, that's just a weird thing. Weird thing I wasn't expecting to have happen. Anyway. Please don't kill me. I mean, I won't kill you. Space will kill you. Fire will kill you. Starving to death will kill you. But me, I personally won't kill you. Micrometeoroids have destroyed the pantry and crippled the ectomy. J. Cross has been ejected into space, and Mapia Musgrave suffered a fatal injury. In a fatal injury. Your new goal: survive. Okay. So, if memory serves, these are our problems. So you two are here. You were there. Now, so I think you. If we take Allison, although Allison is struggling, the only person with any gumption is uh, is you, Mr. Blue Bush. So we may have to rectify that by making you have no gumption. Uh, right, so I'm going to deploy you. Yeah, you've possibly got the health to be deployed in here. Now. Okay, so status, status on a one, injury on a... Uh, sorry, injury on one, stasis on a two. Uh, right. So do you only have the one dice at the moment? I can't remember how you fucking play this game. <laughs> oh, roll. There we go. Okay. But the problem is the repair is 12, and if you've only got one dice, that's not really going to happen. So I feel like you might need... I might need to take a bit of a risk and deploy the specialist in here as well. Oh, apparently you can't deploy both at the same time, but still. Three dice... Three dice feel like I stand a better chance. Oh, especially that six is a good one. Unfortunately, injury is not convenient. Um, but yeah, I feel like... Yes, okay, that's not too bad then. So if I drop the pair of those in there... And then I'll tell you what, I'm going to drop that in the research. Oh, okay, no, that's, that's fine. Uh, so, ah, right, okay, so now, if we send, yeah, I think, yeah, it might be better to send uh, the captain over here, and if you have a roll, cool, so, if we pop the four in there, that repairs, if we pop the five in research, nice, I think, ish, maybe, uh, so we could do small kit, plus one health to the active crew member, the moment I don't know if that's hugely worth it uh, especially because yeah special tools that might help me uh, beyond belief right so now the doctor I think the doctor can only suffer stasis here right stasis yeah plus the doctor has four dice which means I think she's going to probably be able to do this by herself uh, Okay, what's the most efficient way of putting the dice in? Uh, probably three, yeah, probably two threes and a two, and then pop that in the science. Pop that in the science. Do you want to pop it in the science? Um, 
And then Mr. Boosh. Hmm. What does Mr. Boosh want to do? Uh, what what were the things we could do? Yeah, that's gathering food, which could be quite useful, because I'm not sure precisely. I think that means we've got maximum food, maybe? Not 100% sure about that. Uh, so that's going to be health. You are currently healthy, though, so that's not going to be hugely necessary. Uh, what do I do in here? What's the sort of... Ah, reduce stress. So what are your which one's your stress level versus your health? I don't know. I suppose we could try and roll a five and hope for the best and see if we can figure it out. But Oh, unless that's stress on the ship. No? No, I don't think it is. That's healing, but you don't really need healing. Plus that's a five again anyway. Uh, is that... Oh, the back of the ship. Is there anything I can do in the back of the ship? Hull repair. Okay. Oh, this is one of those ones where I think, yeah... You have to have... Don't know. But I think that needs multiple dice. Which I don't have available at the moment. So that's not hugely worthwhile. Uh, five to increase assist. Well, it looks like we don't actually have any assist whatsoever. So do you know what? I'm going to take a chance. I'm going to roll that dice. Uh, oy! Greater than five. Just maximised your... You've maximised my assist. Well done. No impending damage. Good. Are you fucking surprised? The whole ship's been blown to buggery. I thought she said if we can't eat them, we're all dead. I remember eating the crew was, a, was an option, but... Okay, so minus 30% stress for all, but minus one hull. That, mm, not great news. Um... So yeah, actually, I think where I said you were full health, I don't think that's true. I think that's stress, unless the other side is stress. Don't know. Oh well. Uh, but plus, I suppose arguably if I do either one of these, if I try and look out for what meter changes, we should be okay. But, I mean, stress is probably a bad thing but then a lot of the crew the doctor has sedatives does he How do you, oh of course down there yeah <laughs> the bloody overlay again at some point i might be able to actually uh use sedatives because that does come from this game but yeah so these interferences are getting pretty annoying i keep losing work to the wrong equipment and it should get straightened out I don't want to just complain about my own wounds because I know you all have them and they need to be treated. So if I'm correct, you think the right side is health. Yeah, I'm sort of, I'm leaning towards the right side being health and this side being stress perhaps. Which does suggest that, I mean, plus one for all the crew means it's being wasted upon you. Which is unfortunate. All the crew appear to have an element of stress, but losing a hull seems like a hefty price. But do you know what? I'm going to do it. There we go. Okay. Oh, I don't even need to actually confirm. I can just do that, and it will show me. So, yeah, we're right. Health is the blocks on the right-hand side. Uh, stress is the meter on the left-hand side. I feel like this is the better one. Keep their stress levels low. Um, but obviously I have limited my um, everything else so food for you I will need to figure out how to get more food that might be your job you've eaten the food now you need to figure out how to stop eating the food oh, okay destruction is imminent that's not convenient um, I must admit you're in there I feel like it is your it's gonna be your ch chance to shine here when we need repairs so on fours it's injury time which is mm, bad i could use my science take a chance on a roll first see what happens come on sixes come on sixes come on sixes good god man you've aced it uh optimal yeah i think it's gonna have to be just be the six five five over by one but never mind and pop two in the science. 
<laughs> and I imagine you're very glad that I've popped two in the science. Right, so you... We're currently not going to die, but I still feel obliged to try and get rid of this. Fives, that's bad, but let's hope for sixes then. Six and a three! That's not bad. That's really not bad. Um, hmm. I'll put the six in there. But I'm tempted. Yeah, what I think I'll do is I'll put the three in the science. And then rely on... <sighs> yeah. We'll put you in there and hope that you can roll a four or more. Which unfortunately means six or four. Six or four. Four is perfect. Well done, Gene. Uh, well done, indeed. Right, okay. So immediate problems have been alleviated. Now we need to figure out this hull situation. Because I wouldn't mind raising the hull. Although, having said that. Uh, so no movement damage. Okay, interesting. Prevents injury to any crew when moving through modules with events. Okay, interesting. Um... That's the food department, and I do feel like I need to do the food department. So I do... I don't fully understand precisely how this is working, but I'm going to fucking roll the dice and hope for the best. Now, none of these actually... Eat, oh, well, I suppose arguably six... D d no, okay. No, alright, fine. Uh, no, okay, I can't get that dice out now. Ugh, that's unfortunate. Hmm. Well, I suppose let's re-roll. Uh, clearly shouldn't have done what I did. <laughs> I think you do need the same numbers, which means I've kind of... Well, I suppose, I mean, arguably a six is as likely as any other point in time. Oh, plus one health to the crew in the module. Okay, yeah, do the class. Excellent. Do, 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 do. Yeah, I think you might be right. Six equals six equals six. And then maybe... Do I just gain one food or would I gain six food? I don't know. But either way, we'll go with that idea. Uh, I, I don't... I haven't really got anything to do with that. Fuck me! Welcome, Albion. Yeah, I don't have anything to do with that dice. So I think we'll just finish the deployment, move on and figure out the next step. Which is going to be more food... And more everything else. Hi, bye. I see. Well, is it just a, a swing, a swing visit then? Welcome and cheerio, if it is. Fuck me! Oh, damn, we might have a chance. I'm not convinced, but we might have a chance. Oh, I don't think I can really sort of. I don't need any more assist, but stress it will stress everybody. But I don't know if I can afford to really lessen the hull anymore. But having some food is going to be very, very good. Ugh. I'm going to take a chance. I've got the food on. Jean. Jean? Do I trust you, Jean? I, tr I trust you, Jean. Um, who you, Jean, is? I don't know, but anyway. Okay, so minus one health or minus one dice all. Okay, but technically no damage to the ship. I'm not claiming it's good. I'm just saying no damage to the ship. So minus one dice to everybody is bad and needs to go away. So I think what we need to do is go deploy here with as many dice as possible in order to get rid of this immediately. Or as immediately as I can. Okay, so we need an eight. Unfortunately, injury on five, but that's fine. We've repaired that. Excellent. So... Okay, so add a dice to you, Captain. That seems a reasonable choice. And then I'm going to pop that in the hull repair and hope I can roll fours later. Right, now I think at this point we're going to try and deal with this situation. Uh, I'm going to roll the dice first, see what happens. Oh shit, there is a stasis, which, yeah, okay. 
Both of those dice are now in stasis, aren't they? Which means I don't think I can use them. Or, no, no, maybe I... I still seem to be able to wave them around. So, maybe I can't remember exactly what stasis is, but... We'll pop the six in there, without doubt. Can I pop that in there? Yes, I can. Okay, interesting. Fuck it, we'll pop them in there then. Oh, maybe I just can't re-roll them. Maybe I just can't re-roll them. Uh, I could have researched the six, but... Uh, I think we got bigger problems, and I'm going to use the repair module. Oh, good lord. Bigger repair module, okay. Finish the deployment, and now I think maybe we've got to get the doctor in there. And oh, I could do it. Two fives, baby. Two fives, come on. I know you can do it. Two fives. Nope, that is not two fives. That is far from two fives. Um... Maybe pop another science in. I could repair it with that. But we could repair it with that later. What we might try and do is have our specialist. Come on, six, baby! I believe in you. I don't believe in you anymore. I believed in you previously, but now I don't decisions. I think I think maybe we're going to have to just tank a hit. I feel like tanking a hit now might prove to be the better situation. Ow. That hurt. A check of food stores and it looks grim. We may have to start eating the rest of the crew. If we don't find some creative solutions, we'll starve before we ever reach Mars. Yes. Uh, okay, so... Ah, minus one dice. Oof. Oof, losing dice is going to be troublesome, but plus one food will allow me to repair the dice situation. Uh, yeah, I think we'll do that. And we'll avoid cannibalism for as long as possible. <laughs> uh, Mr. Boosh, I believe in you, therefore you can have multiple dice. Okay, oh dear, oh dear. Okay, so the Doctor, could you... Come on, roll more than a two. Or precisely a two. That'll do. That's kind of exactly what I needed and wanted. Right, see so you. Now, uh, I can't remember what the purple dice is. I suppose we can we can sort of look in and not commit to anything. Void. Mm. Can't remember what that does, but it sounds like it's going to be a bad thing. Twos and fours. I believe in you. Roll me some sixes. All the sixes would be very good. Oh, that's awful. So I can move that one around, interestingly enough. I'll tell you what, we'll pop in the research. And I'm going to re-roll your ones. Because those ones were an atrocity to mankind. That's not that much better. That two just disappeared into the void. That's inconvenient. Um, I mean, I think we'll just have to pop them in, but you, you failed me greatly. You failed me greatly. Uh, we'll deploy you and hope. Come on. Big numbers, but not twos or fours. Oh, didn't I just ask for not twos on fours? Eh. Hey, well, not really going to be able to solve this problem. Uh... I really needed you to solve that problem by yourself. No. Oh, I'm done. I'm done. Unless if I select... Yeah, okay. Can I... No, I should have done that earlier. Uh, no. No. We're done. Bollocks. God damn motherfuckers. Because I can repair that, but then that's the deployment finished, as I loosely forgot, sort of thought of. Okay, that harvest food was not there. Okay, interesting. Um, well, we'll pop that, but we're, we're still we're still destroyed. So, bye bye. <laughs> this game is <sighs> this game is this game. Um, on some occasions, doesn't like to play ball. And then it rips your balls off with great menace. <laughs> oh, wow. 
Interesting. Could lose a health with every uh, roll they make. Interesting. Did not know that was a thing. But yeah, even apparently, even on easy mode, could not do it. Hmm. <laughs> it's alarming. Yeah, I mean, I've only got the four crew members, so there's no actual choices here. But yeah, I suppose. We'll have, an have another go, but it's so difficult. We might as well skip that this time. Okay, meteoroid strike and system failure. I guess this time I need to try and make sure I don't just keep screwing up the hull. That was perhaps what caught me out last time. Okay, so let's try and deal with the highest ranking. Oh, okay, no, fair enough. Yeah, I suppose in that case we're probably best to deal with this problem first then. Ding, ding, ding! I believe in you. Yes. Ah, dang, there was one that's been stasis, but that's fine-ish. Um, so I think that can't be re-rolled anyway, so that's not a problem. Now, do I want to try and sort of dice hold it? No, not really. I think maybe just try and get... Uh, no, okay. One more re-roll. Come on, I believe in you. Get a high number. No, oh, well, we'll stick it in the science. Stick it in the science. That's what you said indeed. Stick it in the science. All right, come on. Big numbers, Jane. We believe in your big numbers. Your big numbers, oh yeah. Okay, since I've got a lot of crew, what I'm going to do is I'm going to stick that in the assist and then stick that in the repair and then bring in some more crew members to hopefully finish off the meteoroid strike repairs over here. Do, 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 Awkward numbers. Uh, but I suppose... Oh, in fairness, I need Kayla to basically roll a 2, 3, 4, 5, or 6. 6 will do. It's a bit of a bit overkill, but getting rid of the events feels like the wisest course of action. I feel like if you ever leave an event, you, you're screwing yourself over slightly. But still, I know, I know. It's unfortunate, but that's the way the cookie crumbles. Um, I don't need two assist, but minus one for the crew. That's not good. But I suppose we might get some more people to eat. So maybe that's the secret. Maybe the secret is just to get as many people to eat as is humanly possible. Okay. Uh, let's get my mechanic on this system failure. I believe in you. You can do the repair. Uh, fortuitously, for some reason, that didn't go into the void. I don't know why. I'm going to just accept it. Excellent. Okay. But now we kind of want evens. Maybe hold? Those? I don't know. If there's going to be a benefit for holding those. I'll hold the four. No. I'll science the four. Then re-roll that. It's still a two. Okay. I, I don't know if I... I'm not entirely sure what the... Oh, okay. Oh, I suppose the hold is if you want to re-roll some without others. Okay, maybe we'll put that in there and hope that if I get the opportunity, I can put someone else in there to try and roll some twos. So you, I think, are going to be the best bet to go deal with this, because you stand a chance of doing it in one. Because that would be very useful. Three fives is very possible. Oh, it's not quite the three fives I was looking for, but you did nonetheless do it. So well done, you. Right, at this point, I think the captain can come in here... Maybe. Assuming. Yeah, okay. So, hopefully. Science and a two. Something good for science. Something good for... Okay, that's interesting. I'm assuming like a six isn't some kind of wild card, is it? No. <laughs> need a two. Need a two. Need a two. Didn't get a two. Oh, I should have put it in the flipping... Flipping that thing. 
balls. That do balls. I can't put that. I can't just randomly put it in science, can I? No. So that was a waste. Okay, that's unfortunate. A uh, doctor. Doctor, doctor, doctor. Okay, if I do stuff there, if I can get your ability to crack off, which I can't on those dice. Let's try rolling them again. Yeah. Because I think you have to do it in one dice, don't you? Yeah. How very annoying. Ugh, no. Just wasted them. Bollocks. Wasted it all. I let my fear get the better of me, but the others have proven me wrong. Oh, it's a slightly different one. Oh yeah, I think it is. I think because because we did slightly better, we've got a slightly different cutscene. Maybe I don't know. Maybe I'm wrong. Uh, I can't afford to lose health, so yeah, I think it's got to be this one. I don't want to just complain about my own wounds because I know you all have them and they need to be treated. So, yeah, we're going to have to stress people out, which is inconvenient. Also, we don't have any uh, food for thought. We've got an MOF fail and a meteoroid strike in the front area. So I think, Mr. Mechanic, you're going to have to go here and try your damnedest to roll some super high numbers. Okay. Seal. Pop that in there. Fairly certain I can't re-roll that anyway. Pop the four in, and then I'm going to take a chance on the two and the one. Oh, good chance. You just repaired an entire front module by yourself. That is spectacular. Uh, now deploy you. Roll those bones. Come on, we need you to roll big. Uh, big enough. And now, I think my best bet is to put you in the food department. The unfortunate thing is you've only got one die, which means whatever you roll... Yeah, this is... Oh, plus one health. Yeah, all right. We'll do plus one health. But that does mean, yeah, the captain is going to struggle to do anything in terms of these. I wonder what the best version of this is going to be. I'm, I'm looking to see if I can do something. Okay, reduce stress. Okay, that's a good one. So I can either plus one die or reduce stress. Dependent on, well, actually it both has to be over five. Okay. I think plus one dice. Yeah, I think plus one dice. Uh, and now let's see what happens. Bad things. Oh, here we go. This is the food stores one. Okay. Uh, plus one food, minus two hull. That is not good. That is equally not good, but slightly better. The whole minus one health is not great news. Oh shit, there's a not chosen stress riser as well. Ugh. Does this game have a happy ending if you do it right? I don't know. I'm too shit at it. Uh, <laughs> so I do feel like... Oh, Oh, that stressed out for it not being chosen is just annoying. Hmm. <sighs> Alright, we'll have to try and deal with the hull situation in the not-too-distant future. Uh, Kayla, I think you're the one who needs the food at the moment. Right, detecting new events, of course. The CFC's failed, the SSU's failed. Um... Mr. Blue Boosh, do you know how to rep repair an SSU? Uh, four, four, is that? Good lord, that is actually 14. Well done. Apparently, the answer is yes. Yes, you do know how to repair an SSU. Uh, the Doctor, I think, stands the best chance of being able to do this in one, but. Then again, there's injuries and voids all over the place, which is not great. At least only one fell into the void, I suppose. I suppose I could. Okay, interesting, interesting, interesting choices, choices, choices. Okay, I'm going to use the MC override. Then I'm going to increase the assist. Then I'm going to re-roll those dice and hope for the best. 
Yes. Not the worst of situations. Oh, that's not... No, I've already put it in there. I don't think I needed to heal her. She's one of the ones who did not need healing. But damn straight if I didn't heal her. Right, so I think maybe... Yeah, we'll deploy you to the food zone and hope that you can get... I mean, ideally you get two even numbers right now, but no, that's not happened. Okay. Uh, what are the odds? Uh, do that. Then do another dice roll. And then I, that was a one again. That's annoying. Put that in there. And now I'm the captain. I need you to get multiple ones, captain. Multiple ones. That they're not ones, captain. They're not ones. But they are bloody good. Uh, so, yeah, that's probably a good call. One captain, one captain, one captain! Captain Awesome Source. Well done, you've just deployed the source. Oh. Creepy. Unexpected. Oh. Maybe. But we're going to be long dead before we find out. I don't think you understand how dead the ship is. Or is the message coming from someone else? Okay. So, yeah, I can't afford to do more losing of hull. But stress levels are immense at this point now. Oh. Okay, plus stress. Oh, God. Oh, God. But only two people benefit from that. But I don't need the assist. Oh, can I just not choose? These are both are horrendous. I think I'm going to have to have the assist and do that, but that's not... I don't like that. That was just bad choices all round. A fuel slosh. Um, an arse. <laughs> I think we probably laughed at that the last time round, but nonetheless, I mean, come on. We've just had an arse error. Uh, and the destruction is imminent, so we do need to sort of deal with this immediately which is not great news uh, okay so the sixes and the fives pretty good I suppose arguably yeah we'll put the six and the five in there uh, then the captain doesn't annoyingly the captain doesn't yeah for the active crew member that's the annoying thing I don't necessarily need the active crew member to be regaining two dice the active crew member has all the dice uh, I think we'll just deposit it all into the repair. I feel like just getting that sorted out is probably going to be the best bet. Get Kayla to try and follow up on this. Hope for the best. See. Oh, oh no. Ah, oh, yeah, bastard. Uh, no. Repair that. Stick it in the science. That's it. Oh, I could have done her ability. I forgot about that. Never mind. Mr. Boosh, can you deal with a fuel slosh now? Uh, no. Terrible. Terrible dice roll. Let's try re-rolling. Yeah, as, as I saw, the stasis just locks it in place. Oh, that's even worse. The answer is no. You understand your way around SSUs, but you do not understand your way around um, fuel sloshes. Uh, six in one. Excellent. Yes, that's what we want. Three in the science. Um, no, we haven't got the five. We need, yeah, five points in the science would be ideal. Oh, and what is the Ectomy? Oh, I see. Where did they get them? Well, didn't you say someone ejected from the ship? It's unlikely to be them, but still. Ah, uh, plus one hull, but minus one health for everybody. Living on the edge. Uh, minus one dice. Now I can't really afford the dice, so yeah, it's got to be the plus one hull damage to everybody, I think. Um, detecting new events, of course. Ah! Ah! God damn it! Five weeks to Mars, and they've decided to fuck me over. Excellent. Um, I don't know. 
I need to deal. I think my best bet is going to try and try and deal with the airflow for hell. Um, to make careful decisions here. Oh, okay, interesting. Uh, 15's not bad. Yeah, 15's definitely not bad. Ding, 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 ding. Okay, that's not too bad. So, Mr. Boosh, can you finish off the airflow file? Come on, come on. Good numbers, good numbers, good numbers. Excellent. So, finish off that. Stick it in the science. Excellent. So, worst case scenario, if we can't fix everything, which we definitely can't fix everything because there's no way I've got enough dice for that. Let's try rolling as best we can here. Okay, so there's a five and a one. Uh... Oh, that's the... Right, I understand the assist now slightly more. But I think we need to get that into repair. Then I think we need to repair the hull so that we at least don't die immediately. And then, yeah, basically, crewman silver. If you could try and get in there, but ultimately you're only rolling one die, so... Uh, middle ground, let's try the re-roll. Middle ground again, let's try the re-roll. Worse. That's what we want. And gone. Alison. I think we're going to have to have words, Alison. And those words are, for fuck's sake. Ow. I don't think there's any way of recovering from this position, is there? Because <laughs> there's going to be more issues. I think we're going to have to go with um, eating people. Because I need more dice. Uh, plus one health, minus one. Oh, uh, that would actually kill... Mr. Blue Boosh. Um, minus one dice for all crew, but there's no dice away from anybody else. But still, minus the stress, I suppose. And yeah, I'm wondering if we're going to have to start cannibalising people because the destruction is imminent. I'm sorry, Alison. You have to eat a person. I'm sorry, Mr. Blue Boosh. You're going to have to eat a person. And I'm sorry, Kayla. You're going to have to eat a person. Mm -hmm. I'm not going to actually actively kill a crew member. Uh, well, I suppose we're going to have to deal with the dehumidifier first, because otherwise that's going to be a problem. Unfortunately, that's going to cause you damage, so maybe you... Yeah, you don't get damaged because you're not leaving a situation. Come on! Two fours! Meaty dice! He's got himself some meaty dice. Uh, I think we just need to deal with it. <laughs> Meaty bloody dice. Because he's eating all the people. He's got himself some meaty dice. Uh, we have no science, unfortunately. Uh, I don't think I can see a way out of this situation. Because the problem is, I kind of need to deal with the the Gilu. But if I do deal with Gilu, I can at least move my crew without them being damaged. Uh, that's an awkward. Well, that was an injury, so that's even more awkward. But yeah, that's an awkward number of. Uh, it's just a generally awkward number. So that's annoying. Alright, the Doctor. I think my best bet is going to go after the 18 and hope for the best. Oh, the Doctor's got bloody dice as well. Le oh, damn it. Two disappeared. Well, I don't know. Nine in two dice in order to survive. That's only five. And they've both gone into the void. I hate this game. It's so hard. They just throw so much. And there's no dice in the world can solve all of these problems. I think maybe five or above to activate things feels like it's a bit much. 
because that's a two in six chance to be able to get something important and I don't know if that's reasonable but there you go apparently sometimes fixing an event head on is not the way to go I, I feel like it is though reading the strategies. Okay, how spending those dice on module ability might benefit you more in the long run. But the bloody bullshit. <laughs> oh, easy mode again. It's like you have to you have to repair everything because otherwise you're going to get the ship destroyed. Oh god, minus one food. That's not what we need. I think we need to deal with that. That's an important one. But I suppose maybe this is the problem. I keep thinking of these things as important ones when the reality is they're not important ones. Uh, that is a six, so get them done. Right, at least we're not going to lose food. Kayla Jones, I think you can probably deal with that meteorite strike. Surely. Come on, Kayla. I believe in you. Eight is a... Um, Chuck them again. Come on. Eight is a good, easy number to get. That's awkward. Uh, I'll tell you what. We'll get you some health. And get you that. And now get you in there. Because with one dice, surely. Come on. Come on. Are you shitting me? Are you actually shitting on my nards? i going to stick that in research, considering how much of an insult it was. Get you down to this area now as well. Come on. Two and a one. Uh, that's another fucking insult, but repaired. And then... Fucking... I don't think that... I don't think they take over from one section to the next section. Yes, mood is, my mood is turning sour. I promise you that. Ah, uh, do 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 you does repair good well on occasion on occasion um, not always i assure you of that not always god damn minus one hole seems like a terrible idea uh you've earned some food and you've earned some food let's go detecting new events wire short and minus one health for all i feel like that's a thing that needs to be dealt with immediately so doctor strikes me as you're the best one to be repairing oxygen filters I don't think that's true, but it's fine. Uh, ah! Bloody void! Yeah. Have I mentioned how much I don't like this game? Have I mentioned how much I don't like this game? Like this game? Like this game? Have I mentioned how much I don't like this game? Bullshit! Injury! Double injury! Okay, excellent. Well, I'll tell you what. You can regain dice. Oh, I see. Actually, regain dice, you just have to do one and you'll earn two. So that's probably a waste. Oh, I've put them in there now. Oh, God, I wish sometimes there was a way to change your mind. That would help out, no doubt, as well. Try and deal with this with you, please. Come on, sir. Come on. No! Why are you such an asshole? Alison, you kick. Alison! Alison! You can't keep screwing us over, Alison. I mean, she is. She seems desperately trying to kill everybody. Uh, Mr. Boosh, get to the front. Sort out those wires. Stick your fingers in the wiring. That's what we need. I was only moving it to see the details game. Okay. Bam. No. Bam. Bam. No. Uh, yeah. I know that the event's complete, but I'm trying to do other things again. Okay. Excellent. We've survived. Oh! Jane! Jane's alright! Uh, in this department... Oh, you've already, I've already dealt with that, I suppose. Mm. But I suppose if I do roll a five, that would be plus... That would be a dice to Alison. So, come on, you can roll a... F mm. Yes, good. More dice for all, and for all, more dice. 
that's one of the crucial things. You really just need so much dice. Uh, I think because I can't lose dice. This is the problem we've got. I can't lose dice and I have to gain more food as well. That's so high! It's so high! <sighs> Kayla, go figure out the one that's going to destroy the ship, I suppose. Come on. Big numbers. No, not big enough, unfortunately. Ugh. Well, the... Hmm... Possibly, I don't, I don't know precisely. I think that's immediate then. Okay. Put the six and the five in there. Give him a re-roll. Hope for the best. Okay, that's an insulting number. They're all insulting numbers. Stick them all in. Cause I can't do anything with ones anyway. Uh, Captain. Get in there and fix this, please. God damn that fucking one. God damn that fucking one. <sighs> Might as well just get the number in and dealt with. You. I mean, the problem is, if I do try and gain food. <sighs> I need both of these dice to roll the same number immediately. And I didn't get that. We'll keep trying and then maybe ditch it inside. Oh, no. Okay, there we go. Good. One piece of food. It's not good enough, but it's one piece of food. Three dice, 18. Come on, you can roll me three sixes at once, can't you? Nope. That's a lot worse than three sixes. Uh, also, I just burnt both of my assists by avoiding the void there. Try the re-roll and hope they don't go into the void. They're going into the void. Well, one of them did. Yeah, stick the one in there. Uh, I don't think there's an impending damage, but I suppose there was a system fail. So no movement damage minus one dice for you. Plus one food, but minus one health. That would kill someone. That would kill Alison. Now, Alison, I don't know if you're necessarily pulling your weight, but... Fine, I will let you live, Alison. Uh, but since you're quite so shit, I'm going to give the the good food to Jean. Uh, so power failure, waste material. Okay, apparently waste material was going to kill my ship. Uh, so I guess we'll try and deal with waste material first. Come on. I need all high numbers. All high numbers, please. Come on. God damn you. Um, let me pop those two in there and then give them another roll and hope for higher numbers uh, I think just get it done because we need to be able to repair as quickly as possible Try and get you in there I suppose roll them down come on oh I need more numbers higher numbers please didn't really. Oh. I'll take a chance and harvest some food for next time. I don't think it's going to be a sensible decision because we're going to lose a load of um, well, everything. But nonetheless. Come on. Two sixes. Two sixes. Come on. I believe in you. I don't believe in you anymore. And they both went into the void. Excellent. We're dead. <laughs> Fuck's sake. This game is a fucking nightmare. There is no winning this game. It is. Oh, God, I hate you. Another system failure. Two damage. Assholes on the stars. Uh, yes, I think. Yes, I think we'll get dice. And Mr. Bush can have some food because I still don't believe in Miss Silver. Uh, one dice, minus one dice to everybody. There's a large fire. I mean, at this point, why do these people even bother? Uh, how how do you... Minus one health, of course. Of course. Of course. Why would it not be? Minus one fucking health. Come on. I need the dice back, I think. 
a nuisance. But I suppose we've now got our dice back. I mean, we could do with hull repair, but I'll stick in the science and hope for the best. I suppose quick patch might be worthwhile using in the not too distant future. Roll that so that we can actually move around, perhaps. Oh my god, Kayla! What are those numbers? They're bad numbers. Why would you keep rolling these bad numbers? I have asked nicely for you not to roll such shitty numbers. Right, I'm going to duct tape the food supply. Because that's always going to be a good idea. Would that damage you? Of course it will. So I either take the chance... I mean, yeah, basically I either take the chance or I die, so I guess I'm going to have to take the chance and... Turns out that whole killing you thing... Yeah, I might end up... Oh, it, no, I did. I did, I did kill you. I did kill you, because uh, the, the big fire... The big fire killed you, and we're dead. Because there's no way... Alison fucking silver with a one sodding dice. I'm just gonna kill Alison. Come on. There you go. Good. Murdered Alison by sending her into the big fire. Go on, Alison. Go into the big fire, Alison. No! We didn't kill someone already with the big fire. No, 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 no. You go into the big fire, Alison. Enjoy the big fire. And we're dead again. <laughs> fucking hell. Whatever the strategy of this game is, I don't know it. Because frankly, if you leave things like they say you can, you die. If you go sort out other things and the dice don't go your way, you die. If you move your crew into a giant fire, you die. There's, there's not a sort of... There's, there's not a sort of win. <laughs> This is, this is why this game is perhaps one best left as a sort of every now and again. Because, oh boy, it does drain the fun out of rolling dice. Because every single time those dice say no, you are a terrible human being and we will never, under any circumstances, give you what you would like. Uh, but yeah, I'm assuming... You need to be a little bit more fluid in your willingness to do things in certain ways. But, oh, I do not know. I do not know how you beat that game, because that is just... You do not have enough dice. And the problem is, if you don't have enough dice, you can't solve the problems. If you can't solve the problems, you can't go off and get extra things. Or, you don't solve the problems, and you go off and get extra things. And then you might be able to get more dice. But then you've not solved the problem, so the ship explodes. So, so if, you, if you fix the problems, the ship explodes. If you don't fix the problems, the ship explodes. If you go off and get extra things, the ship explodes. If you don't go and get extra things, the ship explodes. Are you seeing a pattern here that no matter what option you choose, the ship explodes? Because that's the pattern I'm seeing whilst playing that game. The pattern of the ship explodes. I fear that is your only outcome. I don't think there is a happy ending. You asked if there was a happy ending. I don't think there is. I think the, literally the only ending there is, is the ship explodes. Right, let's have a look at some of these options here. We can have a look around and see, see what, oh, do you know what? Yeah. Fuck it. We're going to have a go at that. This is probably only going to be sort of a, 20, 25 minute, but nonetheless, this one's quite entertaining. Probably need a new source for it as well, so we'll have to deal with that situation, but uh, that shouldn't, hopefully, shouldn't be too troublesome. Uh, do, 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 do. Dun, dun. Game capture. Uh, let's try and get it. Spelt correctly, as best I can. Doesn't make that much difference, I suppose, as long as the window exists, but... What can I say? I'm picky, and I like to make sure everything is very specific. Marvellous. That's the one we want. 
Now hopefully if we just paste the transform. Excellent, that's what we like to see. Well, we'll start off insulting a CPU. I don't know precisely, I think. Uh, instant argument? Yeah, fuck it, instant argument. We'll just do a couple of random ones. Uh, so we've got a fellow who's locked here. I don't know who that is. We've got Mrs. Maggie, Mr. J. Shufflebottom. Another locked fella. H.P. Lovecraft. Albert locked. Locked. But I'm assuming some kind of ninja. Uh, Nigel H. And Sir Knight. Let's be Nigel H. He looks like he's a crazy I'm motherfucker. Nigel. I'm Nigel. Nigel had problems with saying no. He couldn't say no when he was offered a lifetime gym membership and he built a perfect body. He couldn't say no to a modelling agency and became famous. Nor could he refuse when they asked him to wear nothing but fancy flip-flops for an advertisement. And he became rich. And then he spent one summer at his grandma's who cooked plateful, platefuls of goodies every day. He valiantly tried to fight the greatest battle of all, but lost. You just can't say no to your granny. I wish I was slim and handsome again. <laughs> I mean... What in the... Oh, I see... That's the noise, uh, I, I got very confused there, because that's the, the noise from what's it, I think. Or close approximation to the Nigel Thornbury, wasn't it, or something? Uh, which I'm assuming maybe this is what he's meant to be ripping off, but, uh, yeah, train compartment. Yeah, train compartment, I don't know. Go into the train department. Oh, I need to update the uh, game, so. Uh, oh, there's a game called Oh Shit. That's the one we want. Oh, sir. Uh, and it looked like there was... Was that a second one? Oh yeah, there's a Hollywood roast one. I don't know if that would be as entertaining, because I don't know that much in the way of Hollywood. Uh, no, continue Excuse all of the things. Me, I believe this is my seat. I don't think it is. I think it's my seat. Does it have your name on it? I don't think so, but I have a ticket. First class, eh? You don't look like first class to me. Settle it. Okay, so... Uh, your son... Oh, shit, was I supposed to do more? Oh, no, he's taken that. Yep, so I've got now... Uh, your son looks like... If he steals hamster... Okay, no, that's fine. Your son looks like a hamster. Oh, he's, he's gone for these tea. Um... Do, do, do. I suppose let's do and. Uh, I could have used my T and, but never mind. Um, sucks at Overwatch. We'll just go with the keep it simple. And then I think that's the button to say I'm Your done. There we go. Like a hamster and sucks at Overwatch. Ooh. Thirteen uh, points of heavy hitting insult. Was born in this. I don't think it was. Oh. No, that was, that was pathetic, mm. mate. That was pathetic. Oh, I want your wife. Mm. Yeah, we've got to have your wife. Um, oh, get, let's try and get your wife. Oh, I wouldn't mind... Yeah, I was going to say. Uh, your wife. God damn it. I think he's going to take the communists first. We'll try secretly adores. Yeah, he's got... He's got the communists. Um, I suppose we could try and do the continuation, I think. And hope for the best. Oh, he's going for an hand. He's very naughty. <laughs> yeah, I suppose that's fair. And you can't deny it. I mean, I could try and deny it. I mean, the first denial is I don't have a son. <laughs> So I think actually rude. Oh, he's done me. He's done me right up there, isn't he? Oh no, I was classified as distracted. Oh dear. Oh no, I lost my thing because he did a thing, I suppose. That's <laughs> bone cancer. Oh dear. Uh, your sister. Yeah, yeah, go on. Your sister. <laughs> your sister is where you can sit. I don't know uh, if that makes sense. Uh, <laughs> God, do you know what? You can sit in your sister. Your sister is where you can sit. And... 
I think his is definitely going to be better, but mine's amused me slightly more. Your sister is where you can sit and has bum cancer. <laughs> yes. Um, I think that, that that's about as far as I can get. I don't think it's going to be a good one, but <laughs> it's the best I can do. I think I'm being beaten senseless by H.P. Lovecraft's uh, insults there. Homeless man sucks. Can't exercise because <laughs> of your country. Oh, he's got me on my size and appearance, the bastard. Fat. Oh, he's got me again on size and appearance. Your sister is where you can sit and has bum cancer. <laughs> yes. Oh, interesting. Something to do with reality. Uh, hmm. Okay, so... Uh, this conversation... <laughs> smells of... You. Oh no, he's taking me. You. God damn it. Can I do that one and hope for the best, I suppose? Bastard. Bastard took me. You. I should have spotted that he'd take me. You. Oh, I think he's going to get me on the distraction again, perhaps, because he's finished it. Yeah. Oh no, maybe not. Let's think. Okay, excellent. I get to carry it on this time. So this conversation smells of, um, yeah, a piece of battered cod. <laughs> and your hovercraft. Dances like a cold pasty. the one. Oh, I remember the T now slightly more. I think you can get extra words there, but I don't think we need to. I think we've got my insult. This conversation smells of you. I wanted... Did I actually get what I wanted or am oh, I confused now? No, I got um, fish, didn't I? And is very naughty. And the dead one still dreams in Relia. Oh, this conversation smells of a piece of battered cod and your hovercraft <laughs> dances like a cold. Pack. I've never seen a hovercraft dance, but uh, if I ever did, I'm sure it would look like a. Uh, I'm sure it'd look like that. Um, your seat. Worked with was was born in your seat was born in a bucket of vomit. And if I can get the and, but I think he's gonna steal the oh no. And uh, ooh. I mean that would link I don't know if that would help, but still. Makes me sick. There we go, that'll do. Your seat was born in a bucket of vomit and makes me sick. Eleven uh, points, nothing spectacular. Your but... wanted to be <laughs> some bloody minger. I don't oh. think he wanted to be. Um, Whether that's the reality or not is, un, you know. Uh, well, we might as well start strong with your sister. Hmm. Oh, he's going after my seat. Oh, I don't know if I can say your sister tastes like... <sighs> no, I think puts on Granny's clothing. And... Ah, oh, your seat doesn't like your house? Um... Oh. Tastes like... I'm going to tell him his sister tastes like something. I'm going to try my tea as well. I'm hoping for something good. Uh, tastes like... Okay, that didn't work in my favour. So let's dot, dot, dot. And hopefully, hopefully we can get something good. Well, hopefully we can survive your in fairness. doesn't like your house. <laughs> Oof, just about... Mm. Uh, 
Okay, so, and tastes like, oh, the thing you had for lunch. That makes a degree of sense and is slightly better than tastes like your beloved auntie. Because <laughs> that's terrible. Um, I'll try and end, but I feel like... Okay, no. Oh, I really want the acts like. Yes. I've got his I've got his granny, his sister. I've got his everything. Oh, can we just nudge nudge it? I don't know. There we go. Granny's clothing and tastes like the thing you had for lunch and your beloved auntie acts like a grunting so nudge nudge. Rude. Come on. Ooh. Got him. But unfortunately, he's come back with your sister with your seat. He's he's oh he's bashed me. No. We're at an impasse. God damn it, your mother. We gotta start strong with your mother. Hmm. Your mother God damn it. Your mother <laughs> is where you can sit, go on. You can sit in your mother. Uh take an and the African swallow was bought in. Um, stalked. I'm going to go with stalk to your face. Because it's the best I've got. <laughs> and then we'll tea, just in case. Uh, pardon my French. We'll finish it with a pardon your my French. Yeah. Sit and stalked your face. <laughs> it's not French. rude, but it sounds devilishly rude. Uh, the African swallow was born in you. No, the Afrin Swallow was not born in me. There you go. Ah, take it. It's not my ticket anyway. The fuck off my train, you little bitch. I literally murdered for it, but it wasn't worth it after all. Yeah, it was close call. Close call. There you go. Let's see precisely what is the sort of insult of human. Is that based on online? I don't know. Uh, let's see, who do I want uh, to have? I, mean, I did quite like uh, Lovecraft, and I quite like Nigel there. But, do you know what? Fuck it, let's be uh, Messas Maggie. And then, I, d I think we tried this before, and there's nobody playing the game, uh, which <laughs> makes it slightly awkward. Uh, insult a stranger, I suppose. Let's see if we can find a find a stranger to insult but as I say I don't I mean I, it's a fairly well known game but I don't think it's well known enough to have many people still playing it just randomly on a Wednesday afternoon um, but I suppose arguably technically speaking you never know maybe someone out there she or he I don't know, I was got distracted. Um as is often the way. I'm just looking other things up while I am waiting to see if there are any people to insult. Oh yes. Are there any people to insult out there? I think we tried once before and the answer was no. I somehow suspect that it is still very much no, unfortunately. Uh, we're just uh, waiting to see. I don't think there's gonna be anybody out there. So I think we'll have to leave it alone. It's a shame, but there you go. I had loosely suspected it wouldn't work. So I guess we'll go back to insulting on the couch. Oh no, that's, that would be uh, sort of 
I still multiply. <laughs> that's not what I meant to do. That's not what I meant to do. Insult the CPU is what we need to do. We'll just do another quick insult. Uh, instant insult argument. And we'll be a muggy once again. Margaret. Oh, Margaret. Oh, Margaret. And we'll do it in the pet shop. This parrot is dead. This is a dead parrot. About this parrot I purchased. The Norwegian blue, what's wrong with it? It's dead. That's what's wrong with it. It doesn't look no, dead. No, he's resting. Settle it. Okay. Um <laughs> interesting. Uh yeah, your favourite Bond actor. Ah, oh, that's interesting. I feel like he's going to try and get your cousin's car. So I'm going to go in with your favourite Bond actor belongs in one of those cages. Now, uh, let's try that. And everybody knows it. There you go. That'll finish out nicely. And yeah, I told you he was going to steal your cousin's car. I had no real opportunity to keep that. I secretly adore a cold sausage without mustard. Oh. Your house and your cousin's car. Oh, secretly no. adore a cold sausage How could they? Mustard. But in fairness, I I quite enjoy a cold sausage without mustard because I'm not a huge fan of mustard, but I am a huge fan of sausages. Yeah. Rude. How dare you besmirch my favourite Bond actor. Um... <laughs> this feels like it's going to get into dangerous territory, but there we go. Okay, your sister. Uh... <laughs> what did he go for? You. Okay. Your sister changes into. Um. <laughs> your hat. I feel like I could do with an and, but there's no ands here. Do I want to try and take a risk and take it over? Yeah. I tell you what, let's drink the tea and hope for the best. No, right. We'll try and uh, link it into the next round. You wanted to be in this you conversation, I bet. I don't think I did. I don't think I ever agreed to this conversation, sir. You just sort of walked in. Uh, right, your sister changes into your hat. Uh, and... <laughs> your hat... Is he going to take a... Uh, I feel like he's going to take the and, and if he takes the and... Yeah, we'll go with is getting fat, and then hope for a stinger at the end, maybe. Oh no, he went for his tea. Oh, interesting. Okay, fair enough. He's oh, getting fat. I suppose I could, I could take the and now. And... Is worthless. Go on. That'll do. Your sister <laughs> changes into your hat. And I, it's a very long and convoluted way of fat. suggesting his sister is fat. Is but, of course, fat is a good sort of... Thing against Nigel. Dances like your cousin's car. That's fine. It's fine. It's some. It's some guy. It's something. I don't, I don't care who that is. Uh, your your father. Your father. Mm. Oh, he's taking this parrot. Damn it. Dances like your country, I think. <laughs> oh, yeah, no, in fact, definitely take your country, because I think that's going to scupper him slightly. Oh, yeah. Oh, the parrot doesn't like the thing I had for lunch. He doesn't like bagels. Evil. Uh, your father dances like your country. And... Is silly. 
Oh, I think that's all I've got. Your father dirts his life. Your country end is silly. How do you define oh. how a country this dances? I do not know. Like the thing you had for lunch. Well, in fairness, he's dead. Uh, uh, oh, damn it, I've admitted it. Uh, your cousin's car. Hmm. Your father. Let's start with your father. Um, oh, where's he going with that? I don't know. Let's go with... Because I don't think he's going to take an English pig dog after that, surely. He is. Damn it. Um, has worse hair than a public loo. Yes, excellent. That's what we want. Oh, he's gone for and. Ah, oh, he's definitely going to go for a and is deceased, isn't he? So if I wanted to get the and in, nah, we'll just finish it with a young man. There you go. I told you. You can start predicting roughly where they're going. <laughs> and ideally. Oh, he's going for and as well. And wanted to be. What have you got in your arsenal? Elderberries. <laughs> Not quite what I was expecting. Your cousin's car doesn't like an English pig dog and is deceased and wanted to Oh no, Age and Death. He took me on Age and Death. Oh no. Oh, I've I've doubled up my fathers. I've got two fathers here. Uh, can we get a little bit more on your father? No. But your wife? Yeah. Your wife farted on. I'm going to try and get you farted on. No, I'm going to try and steal your still farted on. What were you going for? Homeless man socks and interesting. Your wife farted on your sister. <laughs> okay, interesting. I kind of want to continue this one. I think I don't know. I don't know where he's going with that, but I feel like it's it's garbage. But we'll see. He may pull out a blinder. Homeless man's socks and your hat were born in a cold pasty. <sighs> I mean, I suppose the hat thing, the hat thing could sting. Homeless man's socks and your hat were born in a cold pasty. Oh no, it was pathetic, mate. Let me think. Mm. Right, okay, so. Your wife farted mm. on your sister. And. Oh, poses nude for. Yeah, poses nude for your country. That'll work nicely. I think you'll probably steal the and. Oh no, he's gone tea. Oh, he's gone for a finisher. A finishing sting. Um, and I'm going to take that. Can't exercise because of your hat. Drink the tea for a finisher. Pardon my French. Your wife farted on your sister and <laughs> poses nude for your country and can't exercise because of your hat. Oh, of course, can't exercise. I was wondering if the nude reference. Yes. Rude. The African swallow, and everybody knows that. That combo was well worth the effort. You are clearly not a parrot expert. I can assure you, I'm qualified to assess his mood. I'm sorry. You were right all along. He's probably just pining for the fuel. Damn straight he is. All right. Tell you what, we'll do one more. I think we've got one more course open. Uh, so, Sir Knight, I think we've done before. I can't remember Shuffle Bottom, so. Let's go deal with Shuffle Bottom. And then, as I say, I think the only one we've got left is By the Lake. Good morning. Does this dead body belong it's to just a hint. Be careful when buying games not. during pre orders. I just it to put my teacup on. You murdered this poor man to have tea on do, his do, rotting do, corpse. Do, How could I do, murder do, him do, when do, I was do, hiding in a shrubbery do, with my do, rifle do, the whole morning? All right, you might have a perfect alibi, but you can't deny that. You can't deny that you, hmm. sir, have tiny feet. Uh, your yeah, all right, your math teacher. Hmm. 
I feel like this is not going anywhere, but... Let's see, where are you? Your sons of Saul. Okay, yeah. Your math teacher wanted to be... <laughs> Some dog. And... Has tiny feet. And... Is vile. T for a stinger? No. Nah. Or it's, it's, I don't think Satan's a, a finisher, but I suppose that will have Your to do. Math teacher wanted to be some dog and has tiny feet and is vile. Uh, tolerable. Style was you pimply ass. Oh no, he's insulted my style. Too sure. Mm. Uh, you figured out my weakness. Mm. Uh, okay, so ah. <laughs> oh. What have you gone for? Some dog. Okay. I'm, I'm going after your wife. Pose is nude for. Is he going to... Some dog was... Oh, I think he's going to go some dog was your mother. But Pose is nude for... So I thought I could go for a duck hunter. Yeah. Okay. Pose is nude for a duck hunter. Oh, he's going to steal the and. No, he's going to. Okay. And... Is very naughty. Let's, uh, oh, God damn it! Hoping for a nice finish. Your wife poses nude for a duck hunter and is very naughty. I bet she is. I bet she's a kinky. Some dog. A kinky was one. Your mother. <laughs> oh. Hmm. Feel like your mother was some dog would have been a better insult, but still. Uh, your wife. I never... Did I manage to get your wife last time? Or was, No, yeah, it was your wife, so I can double up your wife. Mm. <laughs> your wife... What are you going for? Your math teacher. Okay. I think your wife dances like a Muppet. I'm going to snatch the Muppet from your friend. I hope you've got a new plan. Oh, because of me. Okay. And. I suppose I could have taken the and from there, actually. Possibly blocked him from using it. And stop being a burk. Uh, your wife dances like a Muppet and he's getting fat. The inverse of what dancing would do. Um, <laughs> and. Is not a part of Europe. Obviously. <laughs> your wife. Dances yes, like double your wife. And is getting fat and is not part of Europe. Yeah, it's wex it. Um, that's wife exit. Oh, he's not happy. can't exercise because of you and stop being a burk. Look, I, oh. look, I'm not stopping mm. the math teacher from exercising. Oh, mm. I could really do with your wife. Damn it. Your father, I suppose. Your father... <laughs> I love the ones when you can get your father wanted to be your wife or your father wanted to be your mother, one of the two. Has a steaming romp with... Oh, I really need your hamster. No, he stole your hamster. Ah. God damn it. God damn it. No. 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 Gah. I've been done in by him stealing my hamster. I don't have any. No. I keep self-damaging because I can't put anything now. He stole off my stuff. No. Damn it. I'm sorry, Mr. Shufflebottom. I fluffed it. Just couldn't. Couldn't quite get there. No! My hat doesn't have tiny feet. You lie. Ooh! Um, okay. Oh, I, I really want your father changes into your wife, but I think he's going to... Okay, no. I think I'm going to get it. Your wife change. Your father changes into your wife. <laughs> uh, I suppose he's going to take. 
I don't know. Was interesting. Was your pimply ass? Okay, interesting, interesting. I'm going to steal the and. Poses nude for, and I think the queen probably. Poses nude for. I think we're going to end up on an impasse though. Let's see if I can get a sort of. No. Nah. I'm going to have to send it out because otherwise I, I think I'd lose. But. And poses nude for the queen. <laughs> Oh no! Some he might have me then! God damn it! Silly. Only oh. nine points though, no, no, I'm in, I'm still in there. A duck hunter, mm. okay. Um, oh, I think I'm gonna have to go with this poor man. Uh, are you gonna take the U? Oh yeah, this poor man. God damn it, I'm going to have to go with Smells Of, but he's going to take you. Oh no, he's going to take of... Oh, this poor man Smells Of you. Then. He's taking the and, annoyingly. Uh, I could take an and on my own there, it would seem. And your math teacher. God damn it, you're obsessed with my math teacher. Um, and... Maybe... Yeah, 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 yeah. That'll do. <laughs> it's the best I've got. I think again, although he's definitely... He's definitely getting a better insult out of this one. He's going to do a lot more damage to me than I am to him, so I don't know if that's going to end in an impasse or not, but... We are theoretically both going to hit the bottom of our and this health bars. And your math teacher were defeated by a cheese shop. God damn. How did all three of those end up uh, defeated by one cheese shop? And a cider drinking chav. Rude. Uh, so it, was, it was a lot more effective, but no. Impasse. Mm. Ah, damn it. Your mother. Yeah, your mother. Hmm. Damn it. Uh, changes into. I feel like your son. I want to. I want to take your son off the table. If I work with your hat. Yeah, I'm going to take and. Looks like a lazy old codgy, a numpty. Yeah, your go for it. Changes into your son. She just and looks like somehow. a lazy old codger. You numpty. <laughs> Oof, 22 points of hot damage. <laughs> did he? How much did he do to my hat? But you sure have a filthy mouth. I'm still calling the police. Damn straight. Please do. I deserve a death sentence for how I treated you. Let me just finish me crumpet. Oh, I don't know if I can let you finish your crumpet, but it seems rude not to. Excellent. There you go. <laughs> there you go. I said it was uh, only going to be a little, but yeah. It was, uh, it's always a fun one just to have a, a brief go at. Uh, let's see what we got. Uh, what do we have around here? What do we have up there? I do not know. There's plenty of things, just it's always difficult to know for certain what I want to do. But -ba -ba oh, we've not done that for ages. <sighs> Yeah, go on. Oh, this is this is becoming a proper hodgepodge, isn't it? Bits and pieces everywhere, all over the place. A little bit of this, a little bit of that, a little bit of Sandra in your life, a little bit of uh, Rebecca and Jessica and all the other women that that bloke had a little bit of. Must be. I don't know. No, I must have played it since so. I'm assuming it's probably all set up and ready to go. Hopefully, anyway. 
Hopefully it's all good. I'm going to just sort of uh, go in there, but still. Do, do. Oh, no, okay. Have you just plain old decided not to work? Interesting. Interesting. Uh, what are you doing? Because whatever it is, it's wrong, so stop doing that. Uh, no, okay. Try again. Come on. Come on. I know you can play, because I've played you in the past. But I don't want to do it today. Players, players, I want you. I want you, yeah, yeah, yeah. Oh, it's a little over, over the place, but I think it's doing it. Are you doing it for the kids? Mm, yeah. Oh, yeah, 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 yeah. Mm, yeah. Yeah, it appears to be doing it. Hopefully, those guards have good armour. Oh, no, they don't. Hey, it did do what I thought it would do. Uh, interesting. Voice chat is back. Join a party and you will join party voice chat automatically. I don't want to. Opting out of voice chat. That, that's kind of what I would like to do. Oh, is my... No, my controller is working. Interesting. Very strange. But let's go to audio and... Chat, is that the one? There we go. Disable. Fairly certain. Pop the push to talk on as well. Because that will aid in removing any chance of uh, doing that. So yeah, I had a feeling there was going to be a tournament. Because memory... Oh, I see. It's not quite the same memory, but fuck it. We'll, we'll pop myself in a tournament. It does unfortunately mean we've got like two... Oops, I still apologise. I punched the microphone. I feel like I'm in a very strange position today. I don't know why. An odd angle of uh, incident at the machine. Which is slightly awkward. But not a lot I can do. We'll just sort of wait here for a minute. Theoretically, this is not sort of, this is streamer-friendly music. Whether that's actually true or not, I do not know, but <laughs> it's the theory. I suppose what we should do is probably figure out what car we want to be. I mean, there's nothing saying I can't be slime time. Uh, what's the orange version? That's not the right button. That's the right button. Uh, still sort of mostly slime time, just inverted. Oh, those are weird wheels. Agrecio, Reckon Morty special. The preset free, <laughs> which I still haven't named. The DeLorean, always a fun one. Punk special, modern Batmobile, Ecto 1 kit, always my favourite. Tumblr, quite a fun one for sort of muscling people. Flash special, Blue Wizard, Friends Day, Hot Rod, Goldie, Bronze Rainbow, which of course I think. Oh no, it's always bronze, that's fine. Big Hulk, uh, Bugged, Christmas special! Uh, the Tiger Special. Soup! <laughs> I don't know what the soup part is. Uh, do you know what? I'm going to be the DeLorean. For starters. And then I'm going to have a quick butchers in the item shop. See? Oh, it's kit. That's a shame. I already have kit. What I would like... Although, interesting. Kit real life. As a decal. Oh, I see. Yeah, what that does is it just sort of chops off the lower portion that changes colour uh, which is not terrible and the banner for Knight Rider as well that's kind of cool uh, I think I technically I suppose I've got the wheels oh no that is a different set of wheels I suppose that's a set of wheels you can actually sort of um, do oh interesting your platform overlay oh I see yeah. yes that, I mean that's true certainly without doubt true but we'll have to let's see uh I mean, basically, we just want to wait until the brackets are created and dealt with. Well, the brackets are unavailable at the moment. But uh, there you go. The brackets are waiting to, are waiting to be generated. Would you like to hear potentially a strange noise? I don't know for sure. It 
may end up being quite weird. Or was it weird? I didn't look at the audio input. Let's see. If the audio input spikes here, then yeah, so you can probably hear that noise. It's a very strange noise. If you were wondering, it's a it's riffling cards or doing a riffle shuffle of cards. It uh, looks like I am with the Just Marbles, I believe. And we are versus the Dearest Arrows. Uh, I do enjoy an arrow, but they're a bit sort of... Mm, they're not quite as interesting as some chocolate bars. Let's put it that way. Because they are just sort of bubbly chocolate. Bubbly chocolate. For me and for you, bubbly chocolate may make you poo. Bubbly chocolate. Practicing shuffling. Oh, now I'm just punching the microphone. Realise practicing shuffling is of no consequence, but we're waiting for a third team member, so I just got bored. They can't quite do the second part of the uh, riffle shuffle. If you know what the riffle shuffle looks like, you would know what the second part is. <laughs> Every now and again, they're not bad. That one, particularly good. He's farting out the rainbows. Plus, I can't do it just in the sky. I have to have a surface for my riffle shuffles. Much is a very annoying noise, but there you go. Never mind. I know. I, I just don't care anymore. Very past caring. Oh, game one of one. Excellent. Put the cards away away from the situation. I just wanted the boost, otherwise I was going to go in goal there. Whoops. It's been a while. Probably shouldn't have gone straight into a tournament, because that's a bad idea. I am putting my team at a major disadvantage. Ahoy! Ahoy hoy! Uh, Chris hoy hoy hoy! Loves a Savaloy. Yes, he does. Um... Chris Hoy 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 loves a Savaloy. Oh, I don't know where the ball is now. That's fine. All of the explosions all of the time. Uh, it did seem quite close. Oh dear, oh dear, oh dear. Oh, good lad, good lad. Well, these two are quite good, so I might get carried through this tournament. You never know. Well, I got a touch to it. it. Went the wrong way, but I got to touch it. And that's something nobody can take away from me right now. Sort of saved it, maybe, maybe, yeah. Oh, there we go, excellent. Go for it, go for it, go for it, Wurzel. Wurzel, come hitch, come on. No. Ah, couldn't do it. Couldn't do the manoeuvre I was looking for. Ah, couldn't do the manoeuvre I was looking for, because uh, thri thri thripples got in the way. Oh, not quite the direction I wanted it to go, but as I say, I've not played this game in quite some time, so... It's slightly awkward in that sense. Nope. My sense of perspective and ability to sort of capture the ball is uh, proving troublesome. Just clear it. That was all the goal was there. And now, ideally, sort of get back on the wheels. Uh -huh. Do, do, do. No. Oh, 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 oh. Tottoms, 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 Tottoms. Yeah! Nice pass, Tottoms ish. I mean, I don't really know precisely what happened there. So, Tottoms sort of stopped the ball, stopped the ball, everything exploded, I hit the ball and it went in. I'll take it. I'll take it to the bank. Looks like both the game and the uh, stream are probably going to suffer. Oh! Fuck my nuts! Could not 
stop it in the end, but Jesus. Unfortunately, he was too far in and too ready for that situation to occur. So I was unable to stop the ball in the end, but it was still, I think, reasonably impressive. Um, plus, I did just register an epic save, so that's something. Not a lot, but it's something. Oh, 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 no, never mind. I missed again. It was a truly epic charge. Um, just unfortunate it didn't. Uh, Got to be careful at this point as it's going across the goal mouth. The goal mouth. And it's all heading back down the field. It's going to bounce. Going to go in. The biggest of opportunists. I just hung back there and then pow! You see, what I did was I knew where the ball was going to be before the ball went there because I went back to the future. Oh dear, never mind. Uh, it was a good effort while we were making effort and then it all went horribly wrong. Uh, and nope. Not high enough. Nope. Not high enough. You need more drugs in your system. You're not high enough. That is the problem you've got. You need to get high. Much higher than that. You need at least ten drugs that will get you high. Fairly certain weed is one of those. Although I never fully... I never fully grasped the precise nature of the upper downer high, low, all that stuff. Which, uh, oh, oh, Amic! No, that's a shame. I mean, if I, score, if, I, if I scored a third goal, that would just be ridiculous. <sighs> Dang it! I had a melon up my ass. Oh, I couldn't... Couldn't quite get it back on target. There was no capacity to stay on target. Oh, you managed to get a better angle on it. Uh, no, okay. Uh, oh, oh, yeah, interesting case of hers. No, that looked good from this distance. Must have been bloody close. Do, 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 do. Nope, too much angle on it. It's fine. There's always another opportunity to perhaps uh, get a goal. Oh, that was the opportunity. That was the opportunity you were looking for. If you're looking for the opportune moment, that was it. Oh, no. I didn't go back in time. I was very much hoping for that. I was very much not hoping for that. Balls. 15 seconds, I managed to even it up. That's not good. Well, that is not good stuff, so... Now we need to get a third goal, which is not uh, not an easy thing to do. Do 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 do. Oh, dang, ain't got no juice in the tank. Do 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 do. I think it might end up heading to instant overtime. Yeah, that's overtime. Go Tottenham and Verzel. Oh, good, okay. It didn't, at least didn't go our direction, that's something. Not a lot, but it's something. <laughs> oh dear. I didn't expect him to hit that. Oh, no, no, no. Danger zone, danger zone, danger zone! Too far into the danger zone. Blast it all. Stopped it in the wrong place in Trotham if you'd left it alone. <sighs> oh well. Tottenham Oxford. We couldn't do it. He's got a little pink whale upon his roof. And I got uh, not a lot of experience there. Oof! Suddenly they have high ping. Uh, as opposed to low ping. High ping! 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 That's high ping and low ping. 
Well, top 32 is not necessarily a good statistic there, but I suppose plus 350 little points. I guess that'll do. How many points do I have? Exactly the 350. It's fine. Well, we've been to the DeLorean. Let's be Kit. And see what mischief we can get up to, indeed. So what are the... Because uh, usually there is an extra, extra mode button. Didn't see it today. No. Apparently they don't have an extra, extra mode today. Well, I suppose we could try a little bit of... We could try and get ranked on standard, I suppose. I don't necessarily think I'm going to do seven games worth, but still. Can't deny I might put it away in the not-too-distant future. Because uh, it's quite hot and I'm quite lazy. So, all in all, I'm uh, losing the will to bother, but still. We shall see how fares any further Rocket League. Oh, that was awful. You could hear that was awful. It was just pure slappage. Whole point of a riffle. No, that's pure slappage again, but I should really be concentrating on the game and not fiddling with a deck of cards. <laughs> but you know what? Fuck it. I'm always fiddling with a deck of cards. Do you mind not ramming me up the rear, please? Uh, I'm not entirely sure if it was friend or foe. Darn. I really thought I had that one. I really thought it was mine. Once again, I thought I had that one. I thought it was mine. I thought it was divine, but it wasn't divine. No. Stuart. And Vesapuzzi. I don't know who Vesapuzzi is, but he's asking Vesapuzzi. <laughs> I, I think it's Vesper, actually. Vesper Pussy. Uh, <laughs> Vesapuzzi? I don't know. <laughs> I would like to find the pussy. Where's the pussy? Uh, it's Vespa Pooza, I believe. Um, and Lulu? Lulu do. Oh, let's hope Lulu do, because if Lulu do, then we don't have to worry. We're going to win the match, because Lulu's doing. Oh, an interesting sort of weirdness happening there. Oh, oh, oh God, it's going all over the place. And there goes the balls. Oh. God damn. I hate goalkeepers. Especially when they do a good job. Oh, I missed. I was trying to get the rotational thing to get the angle to go into the bloody goal, but unfortunately. Nope. I just plain old missed the ball. I just missed my balls. Oh, oh no, that's good. That's moved. There's the pussy. Excellent. Well done, there's the pussy. We'll have to try and find you some pussy in a moment. I imagine if you try and sort of have a look down into like a, one of the local sort of pet shops, or possibly even better, you know, one of the rescue centres, you might be able to find a pussy. Um, uh, we'll try and find him one after now that he's. Uh, now that he's scored a goal. Do, 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 do. Bam! Just interfere with them. Sometimes that's what I do best. I simply get in the bow. Didn't get in the way effectively enough there. You'd think the fancy plastic name shell that Kit has would uh, be invulnerable to this sort of nonsense. But apparently not so much. Oh, okay. This guy is just doing the... Uh, smash into people nonsense. I wonder if he's changed his mind or if he's just trying to target someone. Oh, that was fancy and unfortunate because, yeah, I think... Was that the same guy just ramming into me again? Because it's going to get tiresome quite quickly. Yeah, not quite. Well, I don't know difficult to know, but I think they've got a sort of ram everybody type tactic going, which is quite frustrating, because unfortunately it's reasonably effective. Uh, trying to get that boost didn't quite 
have the angle I thought I did. I like the little sort of what I assume is a camera bot or something. It's a nice little design. And I have realised that most of the audience appear to be just balloons. Which I don't know. Is that whether they're supposed to be balloons or supposed... Oh, yeah, you try to get fancy, but... I was already there being fancy as well. Okay, there, there we go again. Exploded once more. Uh, in fairness, I think that was just coincidence. Perhaps that was okay. Uh, oh, 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 oh! If only I'd seen and predicted how that ball would go. But unfortunate. Uh, which is unfortunate. Try and get a bit more goal based. Just in case. Good man, Vespa. There's the pussy. Uh, well done again. He's done you again. I do like his little boost. It's the sort of drawn sort of one. It's quite nice. Uh, so Lulu's there. Don't know what Lulu's going to do though. So I'll go in the goal. I suppose I should probably declare the fact that I'm defending, and then that would free Lulu. That would free Lulu to do do do. Okay, Sheriff is just fucking pain in the ass. I mean, if you want to fucking play this game with me, son, I'll play this fucking game with you, son. Yeah. <laughs> See, I have friends. See ya. <laughs> Damn it. Too busy fucking around with Sherist. There's an interesting move though on the end of me thing. Just sliding away on the end of the car. Do a hell of a lot of damage. Should have uh, jumped and boosted, I suppose. But I was felt like I was going to have that. Oh, 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 that's a shame. If he'd pushed me into the perfect trajectory, that would have been oh, so beautiful. But unfortunately, not so much on this occasion. Oh, dang it, are they going to get another one? No, not quite. That looks like this is going to be another one where it ends on a sort of on overtime. Gosh darn. It's the wrong song. The song you want is uh, take a flight into the shadowy shite. <laughs> I don't think we want to take a flight on the shadowy shite, but uh, let's take a, take a shadowy flight into the world of a man who does not exist. The Night Raider. Whooshed, whoosh. Whooshed, whooshed. Oh dear, it looked like it had broken there for a moment. Uh, croc blueprint. It's lovely having blueprints, I'm sure, but it's just like, eh. They don't really do much. Unless you spend lots of cash. It'll be the tumbler. And we shall go into extra and rumbles. We shall rumble in the tumble. We shall get my tumble dryer going so that I can rumble with the best. I'd like to point out you don't have to have a big vehicle for the rumble. I just think it feels thematically appropriate to have one of the bigger, chunkier vehicles um, when you're going for a rumble. Um, it's a weird weird nonsense thing that it's just the way it is I suppose you should really have uh, done that properly but it's uh, worked out <laughs> well oh, I suppose you know when you're, when you're when you're just that damn good when you're as good as I am it just doesn't matter I fully approve of Super Oost's uh, oh Super ODST uh, I fully approve of your vehicle choice, sir. Oh, well, I fully approve of destroying that man. Oh, oh dear, oh dear, oh dear, oh dear, what can the matter be? 
Three fat ladies stuck in the hay. Goodbye, sir. Three uh, fat ladies stuck in the lavatory. Why did they go to the lava tree? They wanted to pluck some lava from its lowest sort of branches. Uh, oh, 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 yes, plunged, plunged away. Thought that was a terrible choice, but it turned out. Damn. <sighs> Just got there first. If only. And plunged. Oh, no, he spiked my plungers. Well, that's just cock, isn't it? Oh, I mean, I do feel slightly like my plunger should have taken it off of his spikes. Because otherwise, there's very limited. There's not a great amount you can do against spikes, I don't think. They are just like the ultimate choice of weaponry. Once they crop up, you stand very little chance unless the person driving the spike machine fucks it up. But, uh, which is why I'm not very good with uh, spikes. Hey! Do, 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 do. Hence why, when I do this spike attempt... God damn it. It's probably not going to work. Okay. Punched away. I think the punch does dislodge it in fairness, actually. Cock. <sighs> Destroyed. Oh no, my spikes do retain. I thought my spikes would reset but, uh, on bomb destruction. I'm, tr I'm trying desperately to find that opportune moment of spike deployment, but just with everybody else sort of fucking about, it's proving devilishly difficult. To just get that perfect sort of spike deployment moment without losing the ball every single time. Oh, that's going in the goal. Wow, that was a good... I think that was a plundering, was it? Not sure, but whatever it was. Fucking perfect aim. Yeah, plunger. Ugh. Too hesitant on spikes, perhaps. I don't know. I just really, really wanted to get them to go well. Uh, unfortunately, they just refused to... I don't know. I didn't want to run into you. You just made me do it, sir. Uh, yeah, uh, yeah, confusion. I saw the targeting rescue, but I hadn't quite factored in what my weapon was. So, bam! Just clear it was my only real goal there. Do, 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 do. Oh, damn it all. Whee! You think infinite boost is something you want to give me? No, sir. Bam! Oh, you little swine. That was my moment. That was my moment to shine, y'all. Oh, I've got another spear shot. Nice. If you can do the spear shot well. Bam! That was just to clear it off the spikes. So that, because there, uh, I mean, I was suggesting there weren't many methods. There aren't that many, but spikes and punching, I think, do work. Why well, can't grab that? I've, I've got 100% boost. Bye. Say goodbye. Yeah, out of control, weren't you, bitch? You didn't embrace the boost. You weren't born in the boostings. Oof. You may have embraced the boostings. <laughs> oh. Ziadawees. Look, I told you, if you needed to have a wee, you should have gone before we started. You don't want to be having a wee halfway through, but turns out Zi had a wee. Uh, who Z is, I don't know. Z had a wee. It's the best the joke's going to get, I'm afraid. Atrocious, I suppose. Ah, uh, oh, god damn it. Super official dick Saint Saint the Saint of Dicks. Trinity, the Saint of Dicks. Or Trixie, I suppose. Yeah. The official Dick Saint Trixie. She is the Saint of Dicks. Uh yeah. Just to show you that first goal was pure fluke. 
beyond all that is imaginable. Because I've not been able to do another one since. Bully mode! Dang it. I think bully mode's working out for me because there's nobody here to bully. But getting rid of it's useful as well. Ah, dang. We got tornadoed. Oh. I don't mind being boosted. It gives me the opportunity to get angry at you all. Can't remember if you boot the ball or boot the person. I think it's boot the person. Dang it. The one negative of infinite boost is it's difficult to control when trying to do fine manoeuvres. Oh, oh hello, Mr. Mr. Bullyman. Teleportation is another exceptional way of dealing with spikes. No, I'm, I'm finding all the best ways of dealing with spikes, even though earlier on I suggested there was limited ways to deal with spikes. Apparently there's a lot more than I gave it credit for. A lot more indeed. But I suppose I can't, you know, I can't besmirk being beaten by Kit. Because, excellent choice of car. I fully approve of that choice of car. Uh, we'll change car again, fuck it. We'll just keep changing cars, why not? And since I watched Ghostbusters Afterlife the other day, we shall celebrate that achievement by going to... If I can find it. Which apparently... Ecto-1, finally. I don't know whether I just missed it or whether it... I suppose maybe it was just the entirety round again. Which is not what you want. Not what you want at all, indeed. Do, do, do. Ah, that was another... Another stack slapper. It's uh, very difficult. I don't know if you've ever tried... Of getting better at the riffle shuffle. Oh, we're against the team. That's not good news. But, uh, yeah. It's surprisingly difficult to get that perfect sort of release where you are just going pop, 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 with just single cards at a time. Whoops. Unfortunately, right this very second, I can only drive backwards, which is lucky that Pistus uh, was exceptional. And just popped it straight in the goal there. Excellent. That's what we like to see. We like to see it being popped straight in the goal. That's what we enjoy seeing. Uh, I don't know. I think it's just the game being affected on this game. But even when I'm playing by myself, uh, I know the, the sort of packet loss thing seems to occur. Oh, shite. Um, no, I don't know. Like, they say about, you know, rediddling the router. But it doesn't seem to do anything with Rocket League. They just seem to lose the packets and that's it. There's nothing I seem to be able to do to improve that. I don't know why. I feel like it must be their side, considering I've exhausted almost every option I've got when it comes to attempting. Oh, that's a good... My God! Whoa! I don't want to be chomp chomp chomped. But yeah, good God, man. Good God. That's an interesting look. Because it's... An anime character. I don't. I'm not going to claim to recognise that anime character specifically. But inside, like a Batman, like chest, that makes it all the more interesting. Because obviously the belt is very much based on the idea of being Batman's chest. Um, so yeah, it's a weird combination of sort of almost anime Murdoch style. Uh, not not Murdoch, Modoc. Uh! Oh, it looks like consider because Night Rider's the latest to be uh, sort of on sale again. It seems everybody's taking the opportunity to use Night Rider, which again I do sort of approve of because Night Rider get booted. Night Rider. In some ways, I wish they would have another crack at uh, rebooting Night Rider as a TV series because I didn't mind their sort of attempt at um, having another go at it. Oh, he's very good. They're very good. I mean, I sort of knew they were going to be quite good because they were registered as a team, which is always slightly inconvenient for individuals like me. But there you go. 
the Hex Thomas. He seems to be their primary sort of striker, and the other two are sort of defenders, perhaps. I don't know. Wee, 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 wee. Ah, wee, wee, wee. I'm only really sort of touching the ball. I'm not really doing anything that productive, which is inconvenient to say the least. Well, I'll tell you what. <laughs> I, I wanted to do more than that, but it didn't work the way I was uh, planning. Do, 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 do. No, never mind. Oh, yeah, if, if anybody else has watched uh, Ghostbusters Afterlife, do feel free to say so. Uh, I quite enjoyed it. Gratuitous references in it. One thing I wasn't keen on was the idea of it being exactly the same beastie trying to be freed. Part of me thinking maybe they could have sort of done a slightly different uh, sort of entity trying to be released, and that might have been that might have been sort of, that might have made it a little bit more unique and interesting, slightly more interesting at least. But all in all, I quite enjoyed it. Uh, yeah. Get out of my goal, yeah! Unfortunately, I think, once again, I think, is that? No. If, that, if, if anything, it's connected properly this time. Uh, bully mode, engage. Oh, dang. Oh, dang, dang, dang. Well, you sucked me into a tornado. My bully mode was enabled. And that was a bad call on your part. Bad call indeed. Punchingtons didn't work the way I wanted Punchingtons to work. That's more Night Rider sound. Oh, God damn it. I'm really bad at getting that sort of. Oh, I'm now infinite boost. Infinite boost, infinite boost, infinite boost. Infinite boost. Oh, and now rammed up the arsehole. Wait! Oh, we are actually winning again. Interesting. I remember it getting to two-two, and then apparently I missed the entire rest of the idea. Oh well, that's the other vehicle I do want. If I ever spot that in the shop, I will probably try and purchase that one, which is the Aston Martin collections. Uh, try and get my hands on the Aston Martin because I think that would be quite fun. I don't know precisely what it does. I don't know what its boost mode is like. I'm hoping there is probably some reference to the guns on the front, maybe? That'd be quite fun. Unless the guns on the front are just always permanently sort of poking out, but... Some kind of... Uh... Oh, it... Oh, so close. I'll get stuck in that... Uh... Stuck in the area and just hope for the best when it comes to... Oh, you've given me extra boost and... I'm bully mode. Oh, unfortunately, both wore off at the same time, making it slightly. Uh... Oh, then teleported. I don't think that helped either one of us, mate. Or at the very least, I know for a fact it didn't help me. Uh, our low light. He's doing very well, isn't he? He's scored all our goals, isn't he? Yeah. Shots free, goals free. He's a one and done sort of fella. He, when he takes a shot, ain't no one getting out of it. Do -do. But yeah, we are actually sort of wrecking this team, it would say. Which, uh, no thanks to me, unfortunately. But, you know, every now and again, I'm sort of there. But in terms of actual sort of use, uh, not quite so much. And sort of, hey! Oh, me! <laughs> I mean, I mean, I'll take it. I don't know how, I don't know why, but it went in and it's claimed it's my goal. <laughs> I suppose I was I was essentially the last one to touch it. That's the only claim to fame I have on that goal. But never mind. <laughs> oh, sent Petrovic. He's gone. Okay. Is this time to get serious? Last 30 seconds, 7-2. We're going to get serious. At least every single person on this team has scored a goal. Me, only one, but you know. Sometimes you've got to embrace the idea that uh, 
It don't matter. Do, do, do. Wee! I've been bringing a valuable alternate service to the situation. And that valuable alternate surface is... Just... Yeah, I'm in Ecto-1. That's kind of it. I look pretty. Which, ironically, is not the service I bring in real life. Quite the opposite. Oh, you're going to do another one? No, I don't want to be sucked into oblivion. Fired up the proton pack just to try and defeat that nasty looking thing in there. I think I did. I think I managed to clip it enough. There you go. Uh, I crossed all of the beams. Ooh. Whew. Just gonna drive around in circles now. You thought I was joking there for a moment, and then I just did. I continually jumped around in circles. If there's something strange, and it don't look good, who are you going to part? Who are you going to call? The Ghostbusters. Yes, that's right, the Ghostbusters. Why would you ever consider anything other than the Ghostbusters? We all love goo in the Ghostbusters. We all want the goo in the biggest of the Ghostbusters. Well, I'll tell you what, we'll finish off on maybe just a day, but, uh, might as well do another 20 minutes perhaps, which is pr usually the average time, 15, 20 minutes, depending on precisely what you're up to. The average day of a day in my time at Porsche. Theoretically, that should kick into gear instantaneously and then we'll uh, just uh, fiddle with my cards a bit more because I've started fiddling with these cards and now uh, I can't uh, stop fiddling with the cards but there you go if anybody else has a deck of cards I can do you a magic trick But you will need a deck of cards. But there you go. That's just one of those things. Let's continue. Load times should be reasonably uh, good on this occasion. Simply because... I uh, played it earlier on today, so therefore, there we go, told you, point proven, <laughs> everything's sort of preloaded, which means you end up um, quicker. So I don't know if you've seen the bigger house, I can't remember precisely where we left off, but I now have the second tier house, I do need to try and get my hands on the third tier house. There is a bed in the kitchen, it's fine, uh, I just didn't have anywhere else to put it. I could have stuck it in my inventory, but oh, I was just stuck it in the kitchen while I was getting the second, the new bed out. I've got a big llama lamp, uh, big um, sort of medical bed. doesn't actually do anything medical, but I keep the medical chest next door. Um, then there's uh, a bed. Bed. What were the settings? Is this the settings for the game or the settings for the bed? Oh, I see. There's sort of a... Oh, interesting. Oh, I'm assuming that's later for when you've got, like, people in your life. Uh, I still don't have people in my life in Porsche, I'm afraid. I've just been focusing, knuckling down on my commissions and trying to be a good little builder and do all of the things. Oh, it's raining. But there's quite a lot of changes to the to the old yard. Oh, fishing contest this week. Right to inform you that recently you had an incident involving an item being stolen from the research centre. At first we believed it to be the work of the Bandit Brothers Tuss and Huss, but upon further investigation we have come to the conclusion that a third party was responsible and has tried to frame the two brothers. The best description we have is a macho man wearing a mask with a husky voice. Please be on the lookout for anyone suspicious until we can figure out who this is and why they went after that item. Interesting. 
special items for doing the Commerce Guild. Lovely, lovely. But there you go. I'll introduce you to the farm. Uh, I've got ripe lettuces, so we'll deal with those lettuces now. Uh, and then possibly deal with some more lettuces in a moment. Pop all of those away, and then, yeah, we've got three lettuce seeds, so we'll pop more. Pop more lettuce. It's not the most practical of gardens, because it's right over the entrance of the uh, of my yard, but you can still technically get in and out easily enough. Just It's a bit awkward. I mean, hell, I can just jump on the garden. I don't even know if I have to jump on the garden. No, I don't have to jump on the garden. But yeah, I've got like a tree here, tree there, the apricot tree coming in there, uh, Cristella tree coming in there, obviously the brand new stuff. And I finally set up the fertilizer silo. So there's a bunch of fertilizer in that silo, and there's a load of these little tiles underneath everything, and it just feeds everything fertilizer. And all I have to do is fill up the fertilizer tank, which is quite useful. Uh, I've got a massive fish tank, so enormous looking thing, lots of fish in it. Uh, it's a bit cluttered at the moment, I do need to sort of exchange things out. I do have, I don't know, again, all of this, I have no idea what has and hasn't been seen, but still. Uh, so we've got the little sort of pet coop here for uh, chickens and ducks, and I do have two chickens and two ducks. And I do give them love and attention every day, and they give me poo and eggs. And that sometimes is all you can ask for uh, in life. All you can ask for is poo and eggs. Excuse me, did you want more than poo and eggs? No, you're getting poo and you're getting eggs. Uh, the old furnaces are firing up and doing what they do best, which is burn things. Uh, all right, yeah, there should be two... So hardwood planks haven't finished, but the aluminium... Which will allow me to finish this boat. Yes, that's right, I was building a boat. Quite a large, substantial boat. It's Monday. Monday, Tuesday, happy days. Thursday, Friday, happy days. Hello, Emily. Are you going to want me to shit on your... Oh, no. Fair enough, this is something else. Uh, Toadie burnt down the warehouse at the docks. Oh, Alright, no, that's not what this was. No, it is... You want me to, yeah, you want me to shit on your, um, <laughs> never hesitate after the phrase like that. You want me to shit all over your pumpkin. Uh, I don't know, if, I don't think that's better. But there you go. Uh, and by shit, I of course mean uh, use fertilizer. So we split one fertilizer off, and then we can deal with the fertilizer situation uh, for the big princess pumpkin. I don't know if it's going to help to have done every single one of these, but every time it comes up, I think I'd end up doing it, which is uh, reasonably good. Uh, unfortunately, I think my horse is still in the stable, so I need to... Unless he did. No, he didn't. If you ride the horse out of the stable, it will follow you until you tell it not to. However, if you do not sort of whip it out the, uh, whip it out the stable, it will not follow you, and therefore... Will not be present when you need it to be present. Emily, I did what you wanted. Love me, Emily. Love me. I don't mind Emily. Emily might be one I consider uh, the marriage situation for. But can't guarantee that. I think, is that in A&G and here? or else? Oh, this is the boat Very situation, nice. I think. Yeah. Of course. I'm sure the mayor will be there is no way of making it anything other than top quality, I don't think. I was number one workshop as well, by the way. Because uh, we've had a full year now. If you are interested. Uh, so whichever one's 1038, that's not bad. 1015. Oh, waterproof cloth is awkward, so. Uh, bombs it is, I think. I mean, I don't know how awkward bombs are going to be, but, you know. Oh, nice new pair of trousers. Uh, 220 plus 45. Uh, oh, excellent. I can get out of that skirt. Get you in some military pants. Yeah! I like that. Could do a nicer shirt, but the military pants I can appreciate. They are good looking pants. Doo -doo. And feel more practical than wearing a skirt for doing all of this building work. But there you go. Doo -doo -doo -doo. Especially going down in mine. Go and do it mine. You don't want to be wearing skirts in mine, I don't think. Do do do. Uh, wardrobe. I still say this is one of the greatest choices of inventory systems known to man. The ability to go, I'm using this chest. 
I can now access every single other chest going. It is a perfect method. I'm, a small, I'm assuming small bombs come from here, and I do have enough for three small bombs. Excellent. All right, well, off we go again. Let's get that commission finished indeed. Also, apparently, oh, there is still sort of mission there. Interest, or is that? Yeah, I think that's in ING. So we should be able to uh, do something else that's extra. Hello, Albert. Oh yeah, you need that cooling unit. Yeah, that's fine. Yeah, didn't cool very well then if it got burnt. Ah, it can't be that difficult. Maybe you can tie up a bunch of refrigerator racks and pull it away. I don't know. Hopefully I don't... Ladies can come up with something. I've certainly not come across well, any refrigerator stuff, but still. Mr. Musa was nice enough to cover it for us. I hope Toadie doesn't go crazy once he's let out. Hello. Hello, Albert. I'm trying to approach Ginger. Don't to get in my way. What's his deal? Well, he probably doesn't like the fact that you're a little bit of a philanderer, mate. Yeah, each, do you know what? Hilarious little scene. I don't know whether there's a different version of the scene if you do it differently or something. I have no idea, but... He decided he wanted to marry Sonia, I think. And he asked me to get a ring. And I did that. I got him a lovely sapphire ring, exactly what he asked for. He then went to the dock. He asked Sonia to marry him. She just went, mm, nope. And they both walked off. And I was left standing there just like... Bah. I don't understand what is happening. Um, uh, and it just felt horrendously awkward. <laughs> so I didn't think... I didn't think she'd just sort of turn around and go, Nah. You're right. I, I don't really want to marry you. Whoops, I've fallen down a hole and I don't know if I can get out of said hole. Uh, I could. Excellent. Oh, was it Petra who wanted the bombs and I've got to request it from Petra because that would be... Phenomenally useful. Well, I'm sure we can build one. Me and you, we figure these problems out all the time. I'll talk with the director and see if we can come up with something. I'll let you know. That new lighthouse at the harbor is beautiful. Thank you. I built that light. I'll show it to you because you can see it in the distance. Oops, sorry. Many lighthouses floating. It's fine. Uh, there you go. There's your bombs, dear. And now... Do do I know that? I'll wait for the results. Excellent. Okay, That's fair enough. Usually she asks for discs, and I don't think she did that time. When I've got so many discs, I could just start using them as weapons, I think, frankly. But I've got a dirty great sword and a dirty great hammer. And a gun. And my gun is quite useful. I didn't realise I could actually build sort of like proper bullets for it as well. That was a experience to suddenly sort of be stood there in the uh, builder table and like, you just want straight bullets now. Oh, yeah, I've just been using this venom shot you gave me earlier. But I suppose I could use bullets. I haven't actually used any real bullets yet. Uh, apparently the church frowns upon me every time I use the gun, so I keep using the gun um, at the members of the church. Uh, not quite that harsh. Mm, close, but not quite. Let's see... Oh, 49 minutes. Oh, yeah. Oh, yeah. That's the other job we want to do. Which is slightly inconvenient. But still, they're only over here. Uh, there you go. If you want to see the gun. Bang. 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 And then if you want to see the hammer. Smash. Can't remember if we had the hammer or not last time I played it on stream, but still. I might as well gather some fur as well, so I will swing my hammer in the llamas. And uh, then the easiest thing, simply because of the speed of the sword, although it does still stutter on combat. Still haven't figured out precisely why that is. Always gather up your poo as best you can. It's always useful to gather up as much poo as possible. You never know what little surprises will be in the poo. Also, I have a chainsaw. So, no bush can stand in my path now. For I can simply chainsaw it away. Uh, supposedly, I think there's meant to be a drill somewhere as well. But I haven't stumbled across that yet. Uh, I bought this. I suppose I should probably show you South Block. 
Um, but I'm probably not going to, truth be told, because there's no real reason to go to South Block. But let's put it a different way. The city of Porsche now has like a South Block. You can use the chainsaw as a offensive weaponry as well. Um, it's it's a little bit awkward. Easier, far far easier to use the Nova Sword. I've only just realised it's called the Nova Sword. It's a wonderful name. Oh, Mrs. Ladybug's here. Well, she's a little bit more tricksy, but not by much. Uh, if you're wondering why I keep killing these guys, it's because I require their mucus, I believe. I think you get mucus from these guys. I'm fairly certain. You might be able to get mucus from other things as well, but one of the slightly more surefire ways is these guys. And you may be wondering, why do you need mucus? Because I want to build a shed. And as every, as every good builder knows, the key behind building a shed is to A, be from New Zealand. Uh, it's a reference, a slight reference to Taskmaster, uh, the infamous shed. Uh, you can, uh, I don't know, uh, hang it in your shed. Um, and uh, the confusion that was had with what a shed was. But yeah, I want to build a shed for those uh, cows that I got ages ago. They've just been lurking in, I think, the farming chest. Which seems oddly unfair to just have <laughs> like living creatures just sitting in a chest for ages. But it's all I could really do. Uh, I, I tend to like to sort of clear out the llamas' homes. Because it makes it slightly easier to see once they've spawned. Um, and the reason why you need llamas dead quite so much is because uh, they drop fur, worn fur specifically. The colourful fur, I'm not entirely sure what you do with the colourful fur, but uh, it is very much the warm fur you're after. Uh, worn, not warm. I mean, it's probably it probably is warm. It's probably warm-worn fur, but it is uh, used in a lot of bits and pieces. That's why I didn't want to do that waterproof fabric one because that would have required a lot of uh, and wood is always a good thing to gather I mean my only goal t uh, for today is probably just burn through my stamina meter collecting all sorts of bits and bobs as I am uh, and then uh, go to sleep put it away I suppose um, ideally if I can get the rest of the uh, I believe I needed nine in total and there was four um, being produced there so with a bit of luck can we build was it iron wood iron wood yes so i've got four i need five unfortunately that's going to take 12 hours not great news but still i suppose it doesn't make that much difference what is this Golden hair clip. I'm going to stick that in the toolbox, I suppose. That's technically it's wardrobe, but I don't know. Yeah, it is sort of. Yeah, it's it's an awkward one. It's technically wardrobe, but it's more toolbox. Uh, pop that. The, actually, no, I don't need that to be popped anywhere. Uh, creature comforts, I believe, was what I called it for. Oh no, interesting. Okay, I may need a second creature comforts. Unless maybe did I? Possibly put them in just the general wooden storage, yeah, mucus, there we go. Because uh, this, is, this is just a generic one that holds just whatever I can't figure out a place for. Uh, glass, a bit of cotton. Cotton could probably go in a sort of dedicated area, but yeah, whatever. Ah, whatever. I don't think that's a solution. Ah, whatever is never an answer you want. To do. Oh, you also get general fur. But as I say, colourful fur, I don't... I'm sure I've stumbled across a recipe that used it at one point in time, but it's not one that crops up all that often. It's possibly one of the specialist commissions or something. Uh, which uh, there are plentiful of. Like those bombs! Do, do, do. We can only take one commission per day, though, if you're wondering. Uh, it's a slightly annoying system. It would have been nice to be able to just sort of, in order to skyrocket your funds, you could just take on as many commissions as you could do physically in a day. That would have been spectacular. But unfortunately, the game goes, no, you can take on one. 
one at a time, one per day. Uh, luckily, I cannot chainsaw my own horse, which is quite useful. Uh, if you're wondering, that horse is max stats now, I believe. I trained it well. I trained it very well. The only thing it might be lacking is uh, love for me, but I can live with uh, the horse not loving me. Uh, I can't remember what you told. I'll, I'll give him a pet. Okay, what to do next? Pet the horse. Come on, stroke it. Stroke it. Stroke it real good. Stroke it again. Stroke your big old horse face again. Stroke it like it's going out of fashion. Ah, oh, that is right. Stroke the horse like it's never been stroked before. So I don't know what that would entail. Maybe leaping in the air, doing a backflip while stroking it. It's probably never been stroked like that before. I'm just clearing out this back area of trees. Because uh, they might as well. It's all meaningless in the end. So I might as well eradicate the tree problem in my backyard. They'll be back shortly. But yeah, I like to just clear out the yard. Eventually, I'm assuming I take over this entire patch of land, which will eradicate these trees naturally. But I don't know for certain. Certainly, I have, I have just recently. I must admit that is bigger area than I thought. Because yeah, until just today, my outer perimeter was this shape here. Hence, why all my stuff is in that shape there <laughs> but uh, which was slightly awkward because i didn't realize there was a fence this side of the uh this side of the sort of coop uh you got plenty of food mm, not especially but i must admit you can just have plant fiber because you you seem to be mostly grown now uh, i could put more chickens and ducks in there but that would require me purchasing more chickens and ducks I had to do uh, yeah, I was going to say, I thought I saw a bird nest. Which, uh, I'm, I don't know. There must be a reason why they sort of go have bird nest, don't have this. But I just, I haven't quite figured out why. Still haven't sort of bothered with that generator, which is slightly inconvenient. The other thing I think I've not bothered with, yeah, still not bothered with this forge. Because... I still can't seem to sort of forge the Nova Sword or forge the Warhammer. And I can't forge the gun, so the only weapons I actually like and want are there. Oh, I, I used the. Apparently, I used the Recycler once. So that's something, I suppose. Uh, I'll tell you what, that blade can go in the sort of. the weird chest. This chest here only really exists for odds. odds and ends that I don't know where to put whilst also being a very quick way of accessing my storage from this area. Uh, it's just quite useful. As I say, um, being able to access all your chests from one chest is excellent, because here you've got all my chests, all my chests laid out on this rooftop area, or sort of mid-shelving balcony, I suppose. I don't know what you want to call it. Um, which I can access from this chest here, right in the middle of right in the heart of my uh, operation uh, come here come here horse I want to ride you again we're gonna do another sweep of the llamas cause I've still got 89 points of killing llama strength left in me also considering how low on mucus I am it is very much a sort of kill the ladybirds there may be another stash of lady ladybugs around here somewhere. Oh, there's one. Okay, fine. Oh no, there are more. They just weren't spawning, perhaps because I wasn't in this location, I guess. But technically, defeating ladybugs. I don't know if uh, Vampanda. I've not seen Vampandas before. Do you give me mucus? Because I'll happily kill the shit out of you. Oh, I see. It's the upgraded form of the pambat. Okay. And no, meat, teeth, and bat wings. Don't know if I've ever used teeth before. Must always try and remember to use the horse. 
I have it following me and I frequently find myself just going, I'll just run it. It's fine. No, nobody needs to actually use the horse they've paid for and uh, is following them, no. I just like the comfort to know that it exists. Yeah, I'm super low on mucus at the moment. Uh, I suppose I need to sort of make the protagonist ill in some fashion, I suppose. I suppose, arguably, running around in the rain, that's probably going to do it. Tomorrow she's going to be uh, ill in bed, and uh, and plenty of mucus all over the place. Mucus for days. All of the mucus will be yours. So over there in the distance, you can see the lighthouse now. Even clearer now that it's late night as well. But uh, I built the light on top of that, and the uh, big harbour crane as well. So, middle distance of the screen. Uh, built that as well. Um, so we've come quite far. We've come quite far. But that's because I've learnt the secrets of shooting it at quite substantial a distance. Do do do. Let's see if we can do another run at these other ladybugs. Excellent. You may look dapper in your little shirts, but that's not gonna stop me killing you. And you've got plenty of those scarves. I think they the scarves go straight in the to be sold. Um, bucket. But oh, I suppose I've only just realised that they are panda bats, aren't they? Yeah. I never really appreciated the pan part being panda. I don't know why. I suppose it's just because I've never really looked at them that closely. This is the closest I've got to the pan bats because I've never had much need to deal in pan bat slaughter. Everything else I tend to actually have to kill fairly frequently, like the the sort of llamas and other such odds and sods, but yeah, pan bats just don't seem to have ever been a thing. I don't think you have mucus, do you? But I suppose gathering your bits, you never know. You never know when I'm gonna need your bits. I may need your bits today, I may need your bits tomorrow. You need, may never need your bits, and in which case there's a terrible waste of time, but never mind. Might take this tree as well. No, no, I don't have enough energy for, do, for that. I could make a start on removing that tree, but since I've run out of energy, I might as well not do that. We'll pop back, see if we can find some more of those ladybugs, because they're definitely the ones that give me the stuff I need. Whereas everything else... For today, everything else gets a pass, and they get to live. Any more ladybugs around here? Excellent. Do, do, do. Yeah, and one last kill with my one last piece of energy. Spectacular news, sir. But when I rearrange the yard, I'm probably going to, A, try and remember to factor in the fact that there is a gate on this thing. Oh, the fuels are deflated. That's a shame. That's where I need to start trying to figure out the power situation. Uh, get the conductive flooring in and then I can start using the furnace to power things. Although, truth be told, I'm not sure if that works for this sort of furnace or not. Um, if it doesn't, then balls. That would be awkward. Definitely work with this one. It's just my theory at the moment is it's only going to work for machines that require power power whereas this is fueled by wood um, machines such as this are fueled by the power stones um, and therefore probably able to be used from this generator but as I say I've not quite not quite gotten around to sort of figuring that out it's uh, sufficiently sort of simple to just get around and deal with these things and not worry too much about it. Now I'll take those bronze pipes. Was that part of that situation? Yes it was. Uh, basically this is what I'm trying to do in terms of shids. So I need nine nine hardwood planks? Yeah, nine hardwood planks, five bronze pipes and nine of these iron wooden planks. Unfortunately that is going to be a job for tomorrow because I literally don't have three hours on the clock, otherwise it's going to throw me out and let me sleep 
wherever I lay. I sleep where I lay and I lay where I sleep. Go to sleep, might as well. Ding dong dong. Ding and a ding and a dong. That's right. Would you please help ding my dong? Maybe. I cannot guarantee this. Anyway, there you go. That's a little bit of Porsche. Uh, we'll probably be back for tomorrow um, and do uh, Dragon Quest Builders 2 and Graveyard Keeper. Because, as specified, I will probably do some pottering around in Dragon Quest Builders 2 before figuring out what to replace it with. Because uh, figuring that out is going to be difficult. Anyway, I'm moderately confident it's just me, so probably just leave any raiding um, and therefore say cheerio. Uh, yeah, cheerio.